welcome to the world of villains! We've got a lineup of the top 10 villains of all time, from Darth Vader to Cruella Deville. They're all here to take you on adventures from Star Wars to magical realms. So buckle up and enjoy the ride! Number 10. The Wicked Witch of the West and the Wizard of Oz This wicked lady, famous from the Wizard of Oz, is the one always rocking a broomstick and a water pouring pail. What's her deal? Power and control over the land of Oz. With her magical mojo, she is cooking up trouble for anyone who crosses her path. That dark face with the dark threads always sends chills down everyone's spine. In the story, she faces tons of ups and downs, always pulling off risky moves to get what she wants. No holds barred. <laughs> Number 9. Cruella de Vil in 101 Dalmatians Let's talk about Cruella de Vil, the lady who always rocks some fancy threads and a serious attitude. What's her deal? She's on a mission to snag a bunch of Dalmatian pupskins for some high-end coats. While she looks all stylish on the outside, inside, she's all about that mean streak and envy. She never backs down from doing whatever it takes to reach her goal, even if it means pulling off the nastiest stuff imaginable. She's all about her own agenda, no matter who gets in her way. But here's the kicker. Our smart Dalmatian pals and their genius duo always end up facing her head on and coming out on top leaving Cruella in the dust. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? You, uh... Number 8. Nurse Ratched and One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest Alright, let's break down Nurse Ratched, the boss lady from One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. She's a powerhouse nurse running the show at a mental hospital. What's her deal? She's all about controlling patients with her tough and downright mean methods. This lady doesn't give patients a say and calls all the shots herself. She puts immense pressure on patients and turns their life into a living hell. Not only does she torment patients, but with her unfair practices, she throws off the whole hospital staff too. She is truly a symbol of unjust power and misery. Number 7. Norman Bates in Psycho Alright, let's dive into Norman Bates from Psycho. He's the keeper of this eerie model with a really twisted backstory. What's up with him? Well, Norman's got this super weird and complicated relationship with his dear old mom that basically dictates everything he does. She's the boss, calling all the shots and controlling his every move. He seems to do anything to keep his mom's love, even if it means getting his hand dirty with some seriously shady stuff. For audiences, Norman's this intriguing and complex character who always keeps us guessing, and let's be real, a little creeped out. Number 6. Sauron in the Lords of the Rings Alright, let's talk about Sauron from the Lords of the Rings. He is this mega evil dude on a quest to get his hands on a special magical ring called One Ring. This ring? It's got some serious mojo. Whoever controls it basically controls everything. Sauron's all about power and control, and he's pulling out all the stuffs to dominate the world. For the main characters like Frodo and his crew, their main mission is to find the ring and keep it out of Sauron's clutch, saving the world from his tyranny and evil. Number 5. Magneto in X-Men Magneto is a major character in the X-Men world. He's this powerful dude with magnetic powers, using them for all sort of things, like fighting for the rights of mutants. But the story doesn't end there. Sometimes, he teams up with the X-Men and sometimes he goes to the war with them, especially if he thinks they're putting his community in danger. Magneto's strong power and personality always hint at this conflict between heroism and villainy, which makes him even more intriguing. Alright folks, now that you've been with me this far, I'd really appreciate it if you could show your support by hitting the like button and subscribing to our channel. Your support means the world to me and it ensures you won't miss out any of the action-packed episodes coming your way. So let's stay together and keep this thrilling journey going strong. Number 4. Hannibal Lecter in The Silence of the Lambs Hannibal Lecter, one of the most iconic characters from The Silence of the Lambs, is quite the intriguing and challenged figure. He's this super smart and talented doctor, but also a downright creepy and dangerous dude. Let me tell you, 
is one of the smartest cookies out there, but in the most twisted way possible. He pulls off his crimes with precision and cunning, sometimes using info that's just mind-boggling. But hey, even with all that wickedness, you can't help but be captivated by his clever and suspenseful antiques. Oh, and Senator, just one more thing. Love your suit. Number 3. Voldemort in Harry Potter Alright folks, let's talk about Voldemort, or as some like to call him, he who must not be named. He is like the ultimate villain in the Harry Potter world. This guy is a powerful wizard, but he's gone all dark and evil. He's out there trying to take over the whole wizarding world using some seriously dark magic. And get this, he's so evil that he's even forgotten his real name and goes by Voldemort instead. He's always scheming and plotting to get what he wants, even if it means causing chaos and destruction everywhere. He's like the epitome of fear and terror, but you know what? Despite all that evilness, he's got this captivating presence that you just can't ignore. Number 2. The Joker in Batman Alright folks, Let's dive into the world of the Joker, the ultimate wild card of the Batman universe. He's like this totally insane and cool dude who always spices things up with his moves and talks. The Joker runs his criminal operation with creativity and flair, from blowing up banks to taking down key figures in the city. Nothing's too tough for him. But here's the kicker, despite all his craziness, he can still crack you up with his jokes and schemes sometimes. Why do you want to kill me? <laughs> to kill you what would i do without you go back to ripping off mob dealers no, no number one darth vader and star wars darth vader he's like the ultimate badass from star wars he's this iconic figure of power and darkness started off as this talented young guy getting into the whole star wars saga but then things took a dark turn and he ended up becoming one of the baddest villains out there. Despite all that power and abilities, Darth Vader still kinda keeps a bit of his humanity. He's like a living example of inner struggle and change. Not just a tough fighter, but his life story is full of twists and turns. To me, Darth Vader is a symbol of striving for redemption and hope for change. That glimmer of hope within him, even in the darkest of times, can still send us a message of hope. Well, wasn't that a wild ride? Hope you guys enjoyed getting to know these villainous characters as much as I did. Now, I wanna hear from you. Which movie did you love the most? Which character was the most intriguing for you? Spill the beans! And hey, if you want more of this stuff, don't forget to like and subscribe to stay tuned for more exciting adventures. Thanks for hanging out with me and keep guiding and supporting us along the way. Don't miss out on the new adventures ahead and stick around for more. Oh, but you'll die. Nothing can stop that now.